Tri-Staters spend thousands of dollars a year to look up their credit scores so that they'll know if they're in good shape to get out a loan. Unfortunately, you can't get your credit score free. But a new report just out today says that money you spend is often wasted. Mark Nagy hoped to refinance his mortgage, so he paid almost $200 to the credit bureau Experian so he could monitor his credit score. When his score reached the mid-700s, he felt confident he would get the best mortgage rate, but that didn't happen. During my call with the bank, she proceeded to pull my credit while I was on the phone, and she came back with numbers substantially different than... Uh, than what I had, had recently checked online by a difference of 22 points. And a just released report, our partners at Consumer Reports magazine say the credit score you get, even when you pay for it, is often different from the score a lender uses. It took a close look at FICO, the company that invented credit scoring. FICO alone has dozens of different scoring methods, and there are hundreds of others. They can all grade the same credit profile quite differently. So we just don't think it's worth it to buy your credit score. It's important, however, to check your full credit report regularly for possible inaccuracies. You can get your report free every year from each of the three credit bureaus, Experian, TransUnion, and Equifax, by going to annualcreditreport.com. When you're applying for a loan, you should always ask to see the actual credit score that the lender is using. And if you think that it is too low, you should ask for them to show you why. As for Mark, he was dismayed that with the credit score the lender used, he didn't qualify for the best interest rate. I think I should have access to the same credit score that the banks and the creditors do. The most important thing is to make sure you get your free credit report each year from the three credit bureaus and correct any errors. And be sure to avoid any website that say free in their name. The correct site is annualcreditreport.com. That way you don't waste your money. I'm John Matteries.